Hey guys, what's going on? So today's HIIT workout is going to be a Tabata style workout. What that is, is going to be a pair of movements, A and a B move. You need to do for eight rounds total, alternate between A and B, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. After each combo is done with those eight rounds, you're going to rest for a minute and we're going on to the next pair of movements. Okay, so then we got four total pairs, 20 on, 10 off. It's going to be a mix of high intensity jumping type movements and a little bit lower intensity, but it's going to be a core focused movement for those. So let's go ahead and get this thing started. First one, you guys are gonna do six high knees, drop down into a high plank burpee. Make sure you squeeze your core and your glutes, and pop back up to six more high knees. And you can pair that with bear crawl, shoulder tap. So get the knees on the ground, core up, foot control, tap your knees, tap your shoulders, reach back, tap your feet. Sure you can for those, but keep your core tight, keep your hips down low. Okay, going back and forth between those two. 20 on, 10 off. Make sure you guys are warmed up, stretched out, ready to go. Let's get going. High knees first.
There you go. Round one, got about a minute here to rest up. Then we'll go on to round two. We have fast feet. Okay, feet down low, get them go as fast as you can. And then we're gonna take it down, little plank, reach out. So elbows on your shoulders, hips stuck towards your ribs, and reach out in front. For those. Again, they modify those further going for high plank, but keep your core, hips squeeze tight. Pass it up first. You want to keep your feet as low to the ground as you can without. Back down a little plank, reach out. Staying low and going fast as you can. Halfway there. Two down, two left. Same deal. Give you guys a minute here to rest up, recover, catch your breath. Then we'll go on to round three. Again, as you guys are resting, I'll explain round three. Okay, for this one, we're going to start off with Heisman's. So what that is, I'm going to slow first, two steps one way, pause, knee up. 
Back elbow, go back. Okay, so one, two, knee up. One, two, knee up. Swing those arms. Like guys, going side to side. To get the pattern down, then you start to go faster. Okay, the goal is to get your feet up and down as fast as you can. Then, we're going to dive bombers. So, you guys can start off in that pike position. Feet hip width apart, hands out in front. And slowly, drop your head and chest down and sweep up. Then guys, two options here. Option one is reverse back up or try it nice and easy, put yourself back up into that pike. Then feet back down again. Okay, there's two for this one. Same time you guys, pick the intensity up when you go into those high movements. Of course, tight and controlled when you guys are doing the dive bombers. Here we go, round three. Pattern down. I try and go a little quicker. Last round with these. Quick as you can, Heisman's.
Okay, guys, time for one last round. So rest, check it out. This is it, four more minutes, and we're done. We're gonna start with the pulse jumps. So, full squat, halfway up, back down, and jump. Go all the way down, up halfway, down, and back up to the jump at the top. Then, We're gonna alternate every other round. So, rounds one and three, you guys don't flutter kicks. Keep your lower back on the ground, keep your legs straight. Rounds two and four, you're gonna flip it over. Shoulders squeeze back, arms up. Move from your hips with ease. The last ones. So, as you're ready to go guys, you get back up, four minutes, and that's it. Pulse jumps first. Down, keep your core tight, back press the floor. Ah, it plays out. Make sure you guys come up halfway, don't just twerk at the bottom. Up halfway, back down, then jump. last time. Make sure you guys are moving at your hips. Jump. That's one more guys. Move out your hips. This is it.
All right, guys, that's it. A 20 minute hit workout. All right, please stretch. Make sure you drink water. Make sure you eat enough. And please get enough sleep, get enough rest. I've stopped by, guys. I'll see you next time.